Derek Splone alongside Lavelle Cook. Lavelle, a tough loss just now, but how's that experience been in the Global Basketball Summer League for you? Uh, it's been a great experience, man. They got some, a lot of great players out here, man. Especially, we had good team chemistry. Today we took a tough one by one of a buzzer beater, but it's been a great experience. And in, in, in your own personal game, what are some strengths that you feel you can offer to an organization? Uh, I feel like I could, I'm a big guard. This whole tournament, I played the two guard. Uh, I could stretch the floor at the three. I could defend multiple positions and get to the line. So I feel like I feel like I got a lot to offer. What are some areas in your game you feel like you can improve upon to become even better? Uh, to get even better, I just feel like I, I could lateral, you no know, lateral help side defense. Get, you get a lot of block shots doing that, and that's basically it. Yeah. yeah. And you have a great story, man. We were just talking about it. You know, grew up in New Orleans. You ended up going to the University of New Orleans, but you went prep school, and then you went. Juco, and then Division One College. How has that journey, when you look back on that and how far you've come, what goes through your mind? It's all, it all paid off. Everything happened for a reason, man. So everything is just a grind, and it all paid off, really, yeah. And how you learned a lot. How yeah. did playing at the University of New Orleans prepare you for the next level? Oh, uh, it prepared me a lot for the next level, actually. Uh, it was a great system to play in. Uh, it's a great city to be in, and... It just prepared me a lot. The coach down there is a great coach. Teach you how to work hard, dedication. So it set you up. Like I said, you're in New Orleans, and unfortunately, you know, Hurricane Katrina struck, and you had to evacuate and go to a school in Georgia. As just like, you know, a young teenage guy in high school, how were you able to handle that situation? Oh, it was tough, man. It was just like just moving to another state, not knowing anybody, and not even having nothing to bring with you. But it's just something you have to adjust to, man. Things happen in life, and... Blessings come through that, because if that would have never happened, I would probably never be here. So you just got to be humble and be blessed. Absolutely. Great journey nonetheless. And a couple questions about yourself. What music you listen to before a game, man, to get you ready? I know you're New Orleans, Little Wayne, or what, what do you listen to in your, uh, in your iPod or whatever, man? Uh, that's a tough question. Today, today I actually listen to Tupac. Okay. Yeah, Tupac, yeah. Are you a Little Wayne fan? Are a lot of guys out there Wayne fans, or are they kind of... Yeah, definitely. Yeah, definitely. A lot of a lot of guys that are Lil Wayne fans, but today I just was a, I was on Tupac mode. Hey, there you go, man. Yeah. The greatest of all time, arguably. Yeah. And my final question for you: What's one thing about Lavelle Cook? Not many people know that you could share with us. Uh, special hobby or interest? I'm a triplet. Really? Yeah. Okay, so two is. is I have a brother, a, a, a twin brother, and a twin sister. Hey, man, there you go. Are they here out here with you, or just? Nah, they they at, in New Orleans, but. Hey, yeah, man. that's a lot of things people don't know, yeah. Hey, man, there you go. Bro. Now everybody knows global basketball. Derek Sloan, Lavelle Cook, appreciate it, man. Thank, Thank you. you.